It was standing room only here at Longfellow Middle School in Berkeley. Family, friends, teachers, and people who didn't even know the brothers are here to grieve, remember, and pay their respects. Family members arriving with flowers, walking into the school cafeteria filled with people who came to remember 15-year-old Angel and 17-year-old Jay-Z Soleto Garcia, two brothers who were shot and killed at a house party at an Airbnb in Oakland. They were my brothers. I know we all miss them. There's a lot of pain in my mom, my family, my friends. <laughs> Tonight, sharing was difficult for all. You could hear the pain in the voices of those strong enough to take the mic and share their thoughts. They're such good kids. I just can't even believe that something like this could happen. And like the hole that this leaves. The family sharing this photo with us showing all six children. The brothers who were killed are on either side of the picture. Angel on the left, Jay-Z on the right. Oakland police say Angel and Jay-Z were at a party Saturday night when three people drove up, walked into the home, and started shooting. Family members say Jay-Z had just called his mom to pick them up just before shots were fired. Chief Laron Armstrong does not believe the shooting was gang-related, but targeted after a disagreement that started from conflicts at school. This is a community issue that we have to remove guns out the hands of young people. It is putting our children at risk. I can't even imagine as a mother, you know, not to bury one child, but two children. Kim Cloud, a member of the Oakland Motorcycle Club, The Dragon, says he had to come tonight to show that this latest killing affects everyone. For these kids just to go out to live, to have a good time with some friends and lose their life behind what? Some senseless stuff, I guarantee you, it has to stop. In Berkeley, Cheryl Hurd, NBC Bay Area News.